Hello Beatitudes! Happy Tuesday! Welcome to class. I'm Cami, and this is Fitness Foundations. So you're only going to need hand weights and your small rubber ball for class today. So let me catch you up to date a little bit on what's been going on. Um, I ended up filling in last week for the last end of the week for some in-person classes because our uh, beloved Mike, even though he was gone on vacation for two weeks, ended up getting COVID last week. So he was out again and probably into the first part of this week, although he hopes to be back by Friday. So we'll see what happens. So on the flip side of that, I'm starting to sound a little nasally. So if I sound funny, that's what's going on with me. So now I've got some sort of sinus thing. I didn't get it from Mike though. I, I literally have not seen him, but the gym that I work at, there's a little something going on there. So <clears throat> I've got a little cough drop in to keep my throat clear and keep that menthol going. And I got tested today for COVID. So we will see what happens with that, but I am not scheduled to be there on campus this week at all. So no worries, my friends. So that's what's going on, but I'm still making videos this week and I'm feeling okay and uh, we'll just see what the week brings, right? Okay, come on up to standing. So as always, I like to start out with a little bit of a warm up. All right, march it right, right and left, right and left. Keep those abs tight. Here we go. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, heels to the front with a push, 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 four more, four, <clears throat> three, two, and one, march it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, toes to the back with a reach, 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 four more, four, three, two, and one. March it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Roll the shoulders with the heel. It's roll, <clears throat> roll, roll, roll. Four more, four, three, two, and one. March it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Heel jacks, arms and heels, arms and heels. Good, keep it going. Four more like this. Four, three, two, one. Cross in front, cross and over, cross. And open, cross, cross. Last four, four, three, two, and one. March it out for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Just your heels, heel and in, heel and in, heel. One more. Point your toe for four. Three, two, and one. I know I cut it a little short and I cut out those kicks because we got a lot to do today. So I want you to grab your weights and stay standing. All right. All right. So let's start out with a straight arm rotation in and out, in and out. Good. Moving from those shoulders, we're warming up those rotator cuffs. Good. Couple more. Three, two. Sorry for the noise. It's my dog going in and out of the dog door because I don't have anybody here to keep him on a leash. <sighs> Couple more. Three, two, and one. Okay, just relax those shoulders. Okay, I've got a new little move for you. 
through. So I'm going to throw in some coordination into our squats because I like to start with the heavy stuff. I want you to glue your weights together and just hold them up here. Now, note where your chair is. Watch your feet. Here's our combination. We're going to squat. We're going to stand. We're going to point the right toe and point the left toe. It looks like this. Down, up, point, and in. Point, and in, and hold. Here we go. Squat, stand, point, and in. Point, and in, and hold. Reset. Here we go. Down, up, right, left, for seven. Good. Down, up, point, left, for six. Squat it down. Squat, stand, right, left, for five. Squat it down. Down, up, point, point, for four. Reset. Here we go. Down, up, right, left, in for three, down, up, right, left, in for two, here we go, down, up, right, left, in, and one, relax those arms, beautiful job, how'd you do, that was a new one, okay, all right, we're going to bend the elbows, now, well, we're going to work those shoulders. We're going to do a bent arm lateral lift. So what does that mean? Bent arms, lateral means out to the side. So we're going to lift the elbows, tilt the hands in and return it. Now, here's what I want you to watch for. Keep your elbows higher than your wrists and try not to bend the wrists. I don't want to see this. Don't lift through your wrists. Weights stay outside the line of your body. Don't ever bring them in here. Keep them outside. All right, ski poles. Ready? Lift and pour. Lift and pour. And bring it in for eight, seven, hold and in. Exhale. Six, hold and in. Exhale. Five, hold and in. Exhale. Four, hold and in. Lift. Three, hold and in, lift. Two, hold and in, one more. One, hold and in, relax those arms. Okay, we're gonna go into some deadlifts. That's for the back of your legs or your hamstrings. So, check your feet, make sure they're in neutral. Toes facing forward, arms are long, weights right in front of your thighs. We're gonna bend forward from the hips, not the waist, not up here, because we don't want any grounded shoulders. So, you can take your feet a little wider if you want. When you hinge forward from the hips, you're gonna feel like you're pushing your butt against the wall behind you. Keep your eyes on me. Don't drop that head, don't drop your shoulders. Your hands are going only as far as your knees. If you're going further, you're doing it wrong. All right, from here, you're gonna squeeze your buns. Squeeze them. Come all the way up standing tall. You're gonna roll those shoulders and reset because those shoulders wanna sag forward when you come down. All right, we're taking two counts down and two counts up to do this. All right, head stays up, eyes on me the whole time. You ready? Here we go. Take it down to the knees, up and squeeze. Down, keep your legs straight. Don't bend your knees. Here we go. Down, down, up for eight. Down, down, up for seven. Down, down, up for six. Down, down, up. Five, down, down, up. Four, down, down, up. Three, down, down. Two, down, down, up, and one. Whew. Relax it. Okay. The last one in this set, we're going to take a common exercise and we're going to flip it on its ear. Okay. Well, we're going to start with a bicep curl, but we're going to start up here in the curl itself. 
Okay, this is your beginning and ending point. So we're starting up here instead of relax at the bottom. Everybody got your weights up? All right, we're going to do a pattern. We're going to do right, left, both. Okay, just like we patterned our legs. All right, you ready? Here we go. It's right and up, left and up, both and up, hold eight. Good. Right, left, both, up for seven. Here we go. Right, left, both, up for six, pause. Right, left, both, up for five. You got it. Right, left, both, up for four. Right, left, both, up for three. Right, left, both, up for two. Right, left, both, up for one. Whew, relax those arms. Beautiful job, okay. So, we're gonna go back to the beginning. So, I'm letting you relax those arms for a little bit because we're gonna pull those arms up into that bicep curl again, kind of. All right, so we're working the legs. Glue your weights together. Hold it close to your chest. Watch your feet. We're doing the squat and stand, right point and left point, and then we're pausing and resetting there, okay? It looks like this. Down, up, right, left, Hold, there's eight. Take it down. Down, up, right, left, hold for seven. Take it down. Squat, stand, right, left, hold for six. Take it down. Squat, stand, right, left, hold for five. Squat, stand, right, Left, hold for four, squat, stand, right, left, hold for three, you got it, squat, stand, right, left, hold for two, last one, squat, stand, right, left, hold, and one, relax those arms, Woo. okay. So we already did the rotation to warm up those uh, rotator cuffs, so we're skipping that. We're going right into that bent arm lateral lift. Bend those elbows, lift and pour, lift and pour, and bring it in. There's eight, seven, hold, and in, lift. Six, hold, and in, lift. Five, hold, and in, lift. Four, hold, and in. Lift, three, hold, and in, lift, two, hold, and in, lift, one, hold, and in. Relax those arms, okay. <clears throat> Check your feet. <clears throat> All right, toes facing forward, feet a little wider than neutral, hands right in front of your thighs. We're getting ready to do those deadlifts. So we're hinging forward from the hips, eyes on me. Hands only going down as far as the knees. You ready? Hey, take it down. Down, down, up, and squeeze. Down, down, up for eight. Down, down, up for seven. Down, down, up for six. Down, down, up for five. Down, down, up for four. Down, down, up for three. Down, down, up for two. Down, down, up and one. All right, <clears throat> bring those feet in a little bit. Okay, our last one, we're doing the reverse bicep curls, but this time we're gonna stay with our hands in the low position 
We're gonna do right, left, and both, okay? Okay, arms stay long. Ready, it looks like this. Right, left, and both, and take it down. You ready? Here we go. Right, left, both, up, return. There's eight. Right, left, both, up, return for seven. Right, left, both, pause for six. Right, left, both, pause for five. Right, left, both, pause for four. Right, left, both, pause for three. Right, left, both, pause for two. Right, left, both, pause, and one. Beautiful job, okay. We are going to put the weights in the chair. Let's do a little bit of balance. All right, so we're gonna put all of our weight in our left leg. We're on the right side of the chair, so our right leg is the one that's gonna move, okay? So we're just gonna point that toe and we're gonna do a single leg lift. Now, you've got some modifications. If you have some balance issues, I just want you to practice a single leg balance without getting fancy, okay? Because the idea is I want you to take your hand off your chair, but it's there for your safety. So if you want a little bit more of a challenge, you're gonna lift that toe. If you want a little bit more of a challenge, don't put your toe down at all. Just lift and lower without touching the floor. So you can choose your level of balance. All right, toe forward. Ready? Lift for eight. It's eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Pull it in for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. Okay, come to the other side. All right. Same thing over here. All your weight's going to be in that right leg. And we're on the left side of the chair, so it's our left leg that's doing the moving, okay? So all your weight is here. I don't want you to lean into that toe. Keep your weight centered over this foot. Same thing. If you've got balance issues, just practice your single leg balance. And I'm gonna put in the last little pull your leg in too on this side so we can uh, practice that. All right, stand tall, abs are tight, Point your toe, you ready? Here we go. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pull it in for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Beautiful job, okay. We're staying standing for a moment. We're gonna trade these weights for your ball. Now while we're standing, we're gonna do a hamstring curl. I'm just gonna stay on this side. Put that ball between your thighs, north of your knees so that you can bend your knees. Because your hamstring curl, you're bending your knees, bringing your heels to your butt so you're stretching the front of your legs. Okay, you ready? Right and left, here we go. Right and left, right and left. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one second set, keep it going. Eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, keep that ball right there. Toes facing forward.
forward. Let's do some calf raises, just like this. Up and down. Chairs there if you need it. Give me eight. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, take that ball out. Come on down to your chair. I've got to wind this down. All right. Whew, have a seat. Both hands on the ball. Push it forward to the heel. Forward with the heel. Push. Abs tight. Sit forward in your chair. It's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, keep it going, ball overhead, up, up, nice and slow, stretch it out, last eight, it's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, squeeze that ball, squeeze, Release, squeeze. How is your breathing? Good, hopefully it's recovering. Four more. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, we gotta put this ball away. I gotta get you stretched so we can close up this class. Make sure you're forward in your chair. You're gonna extend that right leg, heel on the floor. Keep it on the floor for safety. Point your toe and flex it. Fingertips come out over that toe. Breathe. Bring it in, lift your knee. Point and flex right here. Ankle goes in a circle and go the other way. Good, sit up tall. Take that leg out in the diagonal. Point your toe and flex it. Fingertips come out. Good. And breathe. Good. And bring it in, lift your knee. Point and flex right here. Ankle goes in a circle. Go the other way. Good. All right, sit up nice and tall. Lace those fingers together. Round your arms like you're hugging a beach ball. Round your back. Pull those shoulder blades away from the spine. Good. And release that. Sit up nice and tall. Okay, right arm comes across your body. Left arm tucks it in. Drop that shoulder away from your chin. Breathe. Good. Switch sides. Left arm comes across, right arm pulls it in close. Keep that shoulder away from your chin. Breathe. Good. And release that. Right arm goes up. Pat yourself on the back. Take two fingers. Push that elbow up to the ceiling. Check your neck. Make sure your chin is off your chest and your head is not turned. You want to keep that neck right in alignment with your spine. And breathe. Release that other side up and over. Take two fingers, pushing that elbow up. Check your neck. Breathe. Good. And release that. Open up your arms out to the side. Turn your thumbs down to the ground. Press your palms back. Stretching up those biceps. And release that. Okay, let's get those glutes. <clears throat> One ankle over one knee or as close to it as you can get. You can cross at the ankle if this is uncomfortable for you. But it's probably uncomfortable because you're tight in the glutes. Sit real tall. You're gonna imagine this pelvis tilting forward, okay? We're not bending at the waist. So straight line from your tailbone to your neck, tilt that pelvis forward, okay? Deep breath in, blow it out. Feel those muscles releasing as you deeply breathe. One more time, deep breath in. Blow it out. Good. And release that. Switch the cross of your legs. All right, sit nice and tall. Tilt that whole pelvis forward like you're dropping your belly button and the opening your legs make. 
Deep breath in, blow it out. One more time, deep breath in, and blow it out. Good. And release that. Both feet flat on the floor, arms by your side, rotate those wrists, and go the other way. Good, deep breath in, in, arms up overhead, and exhale. One last time, deep breath in, and exhale. Thank you so much for coming today. I miss you guys. I loved being there the last couple of weeks. So come see me again on Thursday. I'll be right here on the community channel. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.